Hello everyone, this is MJ and you are at my channel called Reading This Life. My channel is where we talk fiction, friends, and fun. Today is Sunday and we are here for another episode of Support Small Booktube. Welcome to episode 69. This is not that kind of channel. Get your head out of the gutter. Okay, everyone, I hope you are all doing well. Welcome if you are brand new to my channel and welcome back if you are my Rocksteady subscriber. Um, yes, we are here for another episode of Support Small Booktube. At the end of this episode, I put on my community tab that I would do a little um, fitness video for you all. Uh, we are officially halfway through the year and I know a lot of people may have had fitness goals back in January and those may have fallen flat or maybe never got off the ground. So this is like my little inspiration, motivation, something to try and get you back on track. Remember, it's not about being the best. It's about being the best where you are and what you can do right now, right? Little things, um, you know, add up over time. It's all about little steps. So, you know, if you meant to go for a walk, and you didn't go for a walk, go for a small walk. Um, if you meant to drink a lot of water and you didn't, um, you know, just, just try to improve that much. And if you keep improving that much every single day, you're gonna see huge leaps and bounds, which is um, my philosophy when it comes to fitness. Little gains, little gains, little gains lead up to big gains. So yeah, and I will include my fitness video here if you wanna check it out, if you're new to my channel. I had a little January 1st, you know, get yourself, get yourself going, some tips, some tricks, things to do uh, to get you involved. Um, also, if you don't know me, um, I'm a booktuber, I have a full-time job, and I'm also a CrossFit athlete. Not a professional athlete, just a CrossFit athlete. So I attend CrossFit. Um, I had a little time off, but I'm back now. And uh, I try to go four or five, four to five days a week. Um, I can't go seven. I used to go seven. It's too much. I'm too old and I need to regenerate. I need to do like a Doctor Who thing and just like regenerate my cells. So um, that's that. That's about me. Let's get into all of these great new channels, okay? So again, I shout out small booktube channels to put spotlight on them, to put eyes on them. Maybe it's a channel that you wanna check out. Maybe it's somebody that resonates with your reading genre tastes. It's, it's just kinda cool and it's something that I love doing to give back to the community. So let's dive in. Got some awesome channels this week. All right, so let me click out a Discord. Did you know you can get on my Discord? Yeah, there's an invite in my description box. Um, if you want to chit chat, we talk books. There's a lot of cool people there. The first channel that we're going to shout out is class class pay attention. The first channel we're going to shout out is Trinity tales. Trinity tales has six subscribers and four videos. The about section says back at the start of 2023, my family had something happen that sent a shockwave through me. A moment that sends you into an existential crisis and makes you think. After a lot of thinking, I have realized that life is far too short not to make time for the things you love or want to try. So this is what this channel is. A space where I can share my thoughts with the bookish community and my love for all things literature. Follow me for book reviews, bookish and general chit chat. Again, Trinity details, six subscribers, four videos. The videos that we have are booktube newbie tag, the book that wouldn't burn my first booktube review. We also have two shorts. Um, she's been on here for a week, so give this channel, Trinity Tales, a peek, a like, and a subscribe. Next up, Kevin's Novel Advice. Kevin's Novel, Novel Advice has 10 subscribers, 9 videos. Booktube Newbie Tag came out 9 days ago. The About section is not filled out. Kevin, as a tip, fill out your About section so people can learn about you and people can find your channel. Search Engine Optimization. That's three key words in booktube. Let's see, we have nine videos. So we have the newbie tag, uh, quit, stall, quit stall in five great books you should be rushing to read. That's cute. Uh, six effective ways to trick yourself into reading more books, six short books, six books set on ships, seven books with unusual points of view, four books with unique aliens, six books set on alien planets, and the six places I where I read. 
So, give Kevin's novel advice a peek, a like, and a subscribe. Next we have Welcome to My Escape. Welcome to My Escape has 51 subscribers, 31 videos. The about section says, my name is Katie, I love books, I love watching booktubers, and it looks like fun, so why not give it a go? Her genres are romance, fantasy, and science fiction primarily. Some of the videos we have, okay, buy used books. Uh, that's her most latest video. Impromptu mini book haul. Five star reads so far in 2023. Salacious Players Club may wrap up mafia romance recommendations. Organizing my new bookshelves. Unpack my books with me part two and part one. Life update. Tier ranking book couples, tier ranking romance books, lot, lot of great content. So if you are into romance, romance is um, kind of a lesser known genre to me because I'm not really into it. And I think uh, some people want more romance channels, so this could be it. This could be it for you. Give this channel, Welcome to My Escape, Books with Katie, a peek, a like, and a subscribe. Lastly is going to be, please read your book. Please read your book. Please read your book as a subscriber turned booktuber. So this channel is pretty new. We've got, um, it's been around since uh, for 11 days. 16 subscribers, three videos. It says, hi, the about section says, hi, I'm Carl and welcome to Please Read Your Book, my booktube channel. I love to read and talk books. I mainly read horror, thrillers, and literary fiction. I'm also a teacher and an expat. We have three videos, booktube newbie tag, two awesome summer reads for kids, and a hell of a good book from a hell of a writer. Give Carl from Please Read Your Book a peek, a like, and a subscribe. All right, everyone, so that is it here from me. Again, uh, make sure that you are taking care of yourself so you can take care of others. You still have half the year left in 2023. If there's any little fitness milestones, fitness goals, things that you wanted to get started, now is the time to do it. Summer is a fantastic time because here in the Northern Hemisphere, the crops are growing, farmer's markets are gonna be popping up everywhere. You need carbs, you need protein, you need fat in order to fully function. So um, that's my little tip for you and knowing is half the battle. All right, uh, and also make sure that if you can't get enough protein, there are all alternative sources for protein. I've got this drink here called Ready. It's got 20 grams of protein in it. So I had a salad for lunch, here's my protein, and I am okay with that. All right, make sure that you are taking care of yourself so you can take care of others, and I will see you in my next video, whether that be sooner or later. So until next time, everyone, goodbye for now. Get those fitness goals. Today is one of those days where I just don't want to be at the gym, but I'm here. So let's see what I feel like after the gym. Just did 15 minutes on the treadmill. Still not feeling it yet.
out of the gym and I feel pretty good when you don't feel like working out just do it and see what the results are after you get that adrenaline push you get that dopamine hit and mood booster for sure